Oftentimes when you have a pet, they become your priority. So they, you have to have someone in your life that kind of reciprocates that or understands it. Get him to meet some dogs and me to meet some people. So, you know, that's what it looks like, yeah. You know, I'm not into Christian dating. I'm not into random hookups. And so being a dog lover, I just thought that it was a wonderful opportunity for people that have a lot of love in their hearts to be able to find each other rather than just finding some random person in the park. I wanted to find fellow dog lovers and see if there's any other you know, single girls out there who also like dogs as much as I do. Be able to find someone who loves dogs, wants to be with dogs, appreciates our dog mom and dog dad extraness. Uh, it's a lot being a single mom. So it's important to be able to find people out there who can respect that and support that, or maybe our single dads that are looking for a single mom, you know, uh, all of those things. Gotta be kind and loving. I don't know, I think that, yeah. Maybe that's a cliche, but it is what it is. I mean, having a lot in common, for sure. And if we could, you know, someone who's more outdoorsy and active in that space, and, you know, having a dog to, along for that would also be fun. I think in my perfect world, I would want to meet someone who had a Shih Tzu, so we could have, like, the Shih Tzu. Snickers needs a Twix. He needs to find the Skittles. He needs something. He is looking for love. Do you see this face? He's... Snickers, there's hope for you. And there maybe is a little bit of hope for me if there's hope for you. <laughs> <laughs>